The cast of the next film in the Hunger Games franchise were at the world premiere last night, catching fire stars Jennifer Lawrence, Josh Hutcherson and Liam Hemsworth braved the rain to greet fans in London. <laughs> The makers of part two of the Hunger Games saga are hoping the latest instalment, Catching Fire, does as well as the series opener, which did $200 million better business than the first part of the Twilight trilogy. The results had makers Lionsgate thinking they had a franchise up and running, so it's vital Catching Fire keeps up the momentum. There she is, Captain 17, the girl on fire! Jennifer Lawrence returns as heroine Katniss, and her charisma, which made the first film so watchable, remains undimmed. The plot, however, lacks the spontaneity of part one. This time, the mass killing of young people grates somehow. To do something, we have to calm before. So why does newcomer Jenna Malone think worldwide audiences accepted the concept of death-matched children so readily? This is absolutely insane. It's wonderful. I just can't believe how many people are here. You never get used to it. No, it's crazy. It's, it's every time I, I experience this, it's like a surreal feeling that uh, you can't really describe. It's, it doesn't feel real sometimes. It's like, I, I don't understand. When, when I have Josh and Liam to contend with, I'll never be perceived as a heart, heartthrob. No, no. But they, they've got that biscuit, and I'm happy to follow him behind. And then I got to Hawaii. We were training for about five and a half months, and then I realized with the amount of stunts... <coughs> I'm a little into the weather. I'm so sorry. Um, with the amount of stunts that I was doing, I wasn't able to go... I was going to be taking off my wetsuit, but then I couldn't. So then I was like, I just started drinking root beer floats all the time. I was like, I've done the work, I got the muscle, I could do it. <laughs>